His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa received a cable of congratulations from His Royal Highness the Crown Prince and Prime Minister Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa on the occasion of Eid al Fitr. His Royal Highness wished His Majesty the King abundant health, happiness, and many happy returns. His Majesty the King sent a reply cable of thanks to His Royal Highness, congratulating him on this occasion and wishing him abundant health and happiness. His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa exchanged cables of congratulations and good wishes with the leaders of the GCC, Arab and Islamic and friendly countries on the occasion of Eid al-Fitr. His Majesty wished them abundant health and happiness as well as many happy returns to their countries and peoples. Leaders of GCC Arab and Islamic countries expressed their sincere congratulations to His Majesty the King on the occasion, wishing His Majesty abundant health and happiness. They also wished the Kingdom continued progress and prosperity. His Royal Highness the Crown Prince and Prime Minister Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa exchanged Eid al Fitr greetings with GCC Arab and Islamic leaders as well as Crown Princes and Prime Ministers. His Royal Highness expressed his congratulations on the occasion and wished their countries and peoples many happy returns and further growth and prosperity. The GCC Arab and Islamic leaders expressed their best wishes to His Royal Highness on this blessed occasion and further progress and prosperity to the people of the Kingdom of Bahrain. The Representatives Council Speaker Ahmed Lemsellem chaired the weekly meeting where he expressed congratulations to His Majesty the King and His Royal Highness the Crown Prince and Prime Minister on the occasion of Eid al Fitr. He also expressed thanks and appreciation to His Majesty the King for the issuing of a comprehensive royal decree pardoning a large number of convicts on the occasion of the Silver Jubilee and Eid al Fitr, which reflects His Majesty's humanitarian gesture and care for the Bahraini family. He also praised the directives of His Royal Highness to the Ministry of Labor to provide training programs and job opportunities for them in order to integrate them into society. After that, the Council approved a number of draft laws on approving Bahrain's accession to the Convention on the Facilitation of International Maritime Traffic of 1965, the structure of the Representatives Council, Penalties Law and Working in the Private Sector Law. The Council also approved a proposal on issuing a statement on the occasion of the issuance of the Comprehensive Royal Decree pardoning a number of convicts and also distributing financial support to low-income families. The Minister of Industry and Commerce, Abdullah Fakhro, hailed the Cabinet's approval of the memorandum submitted by the Government Executive Committee on a proposal to regulate trade regarding authorized distributors in a manner that promotes competitiveness for the benefit of consumers and empowering Bahraini business owners. The Minister affirmed that the regulation is an update of the authorized distributor activity at the Ministry. Fakhro stated that the regulation will be implemented on new requests with a requirement that the percentage of Bahraini ownership be no less than 51% and a distribution contract be signed with a company that owns the trademark. The minister added that companies that do not fulfill the requirements may be granted new license to practice the activity if there is an existing Bahraini distributor which allows the presence of more than one distributor for the same brand.